Jesus, look at the time. Horace, we love your hair. We think it's so great. Thanks. I like it too. The problem, though, is being a clown with some dreads, it causes some confusion. And people like to say, are you a juggalo? And here's the thing. Ain't no juggalo. Don't like being called a juggalo. And I know the minute you say you don't like being called something on the internet, it's all you get called. Y'all ain't original. Been called it. I freaking cobweb on my wall! God, embarrassing. Whatever. It's fine. Love your hair, Horace. Uh, but how do you get all that hair under that wig? Because we like the wig. Not really. Looks kind of cheap. But you know what? Old Horace kind of cheap, too. So it's, it all goes together. And the truth is, most of the time, I don't. I just throw them dreads back there and y'all don't get to see the back of my head. But just for funsies, why don't I just show y'all some real ways to do it? So obviously, easiest one, rubber band, throw all that shit back. Loose ass, ponytail. And then wig on top. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Next one, same thing. You don't even gotta take it out. Uh, ponytail in the back. But get you some clothes that's got like a high collar. Hmm, I'm gonna use this. Now, this my cloak for when I like to pretend that I'm a king of some goblins. As seen here. I'm using this because it was the first thing in my closet that I saw that had like kind of a high back. Whew. You gotta yank that up. It's gonna hide your little ponytail down there. And then you throw your wig on. Make sure it's kind of long in the back. Otherwise it don't work. Right? High back, long wig. Ain't nobody gonna see your secrets. Can you see my secrets? I mean, this ain't very planned. <laughs> I could probably make <laughs> You know what I mean though. You know what I mean. That's all that matters is if you know what I mean. High back colors. Put your little dreadies back there. And then put a long ass wig over it. Don't matter. Huh. It's hot as hell. I live in Florida. You think I want to wear that? I don't. Another one. Probably the one you're really trying to be into. Now, when I was new to, like, hiding dreads up in wigs, I tried to, like, Google tutorials on how to do it. Um, they didn't teach me nothing, because it was telling me to do some braids, and I don't know how to do braids. As, like, haha, <laughs> funny and feminine, y'all like to say I am. Uh, I don't know how to do not a lot of girly shit. So, <laughs> I just do some stupid little pigtails right here on the side because it kind of helps me flatten it to my head. Uh, other tutorials will tell you to do brights. I don't know how to do that. And I kind of try to push them to the back a little bit. And then I put this wig cap on. Also, if you put on extra wig caps, like a couple of them, it compresses your little, your big old noggin down a little more. Uh, so that you don't look so stupid. A really good idea, too, is to use big wigs, like big afros. You know, you a clown, you can have a big afro. But anyway, it slides right on there. Right? And then look. Ain't nothing back there. 
It's the easiest way, and it fits pretty good. Let me go see if I can go find a short wig and show you. So I thought I had a shorter wig on standby because I was just dressed like Drop Dead Fred like a couple days ago. Apparently I can't find it, so I got this one, big afro. Like I said, make sure you got a big wig because you got a big noggin when you got dreads. Throw it on. I really love this wig. It is so big and so puffy. This is my Halloween wig. But look, ain't nothing back there. They're probably my... <laughs> Might be a dread back there because I ain't been looking, but you know what I'm talking about. I'm just trying to help you live a happier clown life. Do I want to rock this look today? This is a good look. It's dusty as hell. I ain't worn it in a minute. Anyway, hope you learned something. Hope I taught you something. Because you see me, I'm kind of dumb. And I can't learn too good. So I got to be resourceful as hell. And I made this stuff up on my own. I didn't even look online for that. I, I looked online. I saw them doing braids. I can't do braids. So I just did this on my own. Easier.